In this video, I will show you how to use the new AI synchronization feature in Karaoke Video Creator. It's very simple. First, we need to open the MP3 file. It's just a regular MP3 file. We can drag and drop it into the program window, and here we choose Start AI Synchronization. Now, the AI synchronization window opens. There are a couple of sections here. First, we see the song we are working on. Here are the details about the song. These are automatically extracted from the MP3 file. These are the lyrics. If they are embedded in the MP3 file, they are loaded automatically. If not, they can be downloaded from the web. You can also paste the lyrics here. It's very important that the lyrics match the song exactly because the program will try to align them word for word. Next, we have the parameters. There are two steps in the process, the vocal remover and the synchronization. For the vocal remover, we have two options, normal and best. The normal option is usually sufficient and much faster than best. For synchronizing the lyrics, we have three options. Normal, which is the fastest but may not always give ideal results. Detailed, which is usually the best and recommended but takes slightly longer. Alternate, which you can try if the detailed version doesn't give good results for a particular song. Now, we choose the folder where the project will be saved. The program automatically names it based on the artist and title. These are all the settings you need. If you want, you can fine tune more options using the settings button, but it's usually not necessary as the default settings work well for most songs. Now we're ready to go. Let's hit OK. Here's a heads up. This process can take some time. On an i5 processor, it takes about two to three times the length of the audio. With a faster processor, like an i9, it will take about twice the audio's length. If you use a GPU, it's much faster, taking about one-fifth of the song's duration. So let's start. And we're done. For this three minute, 20 second song, it took this amount of time. Now we can apply styles to the song to make it look better. Let's do this. Here's the styles window. There are some presets we can use. Let's select one. This window shows the lyrics, the title screen, and the credit screen, all generated from the song details above. Before creating the video, Let's check if the song has been synchronized correctly. For those of you who haven't used Karaoke Creator before, this is the soundtrack view. You now have the choice of three soundtracks. One, primary, the original song. Two, vocal removed, music only. Three, vocal only, just the singing. Here's a preview of the lyrics at the current cursor position, and here are the lyrics we can edit. In the soundtrack view, you can see labels that correspond to the selected words, along with the start and end times of the words on the timeline. Let's check how well the AI performed. You can also listen to the vocal only track here. The sun has faded, shadows start to grow You stand there silent, afraid to let me go My bags are packed, the engine's running But I see the fear behind your smile and I don't want to leave you all alone But there's a path that I've got to roam so hold on, darling, through the stormy nights I'll be thinking of you in the fading light Though the road is long and I'll be far from home My heart will always be where you are 
I'm never too far I'm never too far from you From you Of promises made And the dreams we chase but every mile takes me farther from your arms I'll carry you inside my heart And I don't want to leave you in the cold But there's a path that I've got to roam on so hold on, darling, through the stormy nights I'll be thinking of you in the fading It was quite good. You can find instructions on how to adjust the synchronization in the program's help section. Now that the song is ready, we can create the video file. Click the Create Video File button. Here, you'll see several options. This is the input-output window, where you can choose the audio for the final video. Let's select Vocal Remove since we're creating a karaoke version. The video will be saved in MP4 format. You can define the number of frames per second, and there are options for the video itself. The title and credits are images displayed at the beginning and end of the song. Let's create the video. This should not take long. And here it is, the song we've created. I would say the process was quite simple. 